presents the 2019 Masters. Brought to you by WFG, helping families have better financial futures. Coyote, if you have work to do, Coyote has the tractors, UTVs, and ZTRs to do it. Coyote, we dig dirt. Boost, nutrition to fuel your day. Princess Auto, helping you make it work. Humpty's Family Restaurants. Download the Humpty's app and earn guest rewards today. And by Pinty's, making great food fun. It is a busy concourse at the Memorial Gardens in North Bay, Ontario. And that's what we're playing for today. At least the women are. It's the final of the Masters. Let's meet the teams, the leads. Yune Funiyama, a three-time Olympian. Kristen McCush, the seconds. Anna Omiya, Liz Fife, a new mom at third. Keho Onodara, Selena Negevin. The skips, Sayaka Yoshimura, three time world junior bronze medalist in 2013 and Tracy Fleury been to the Scotties four times representing three different regions meet the teams brought to you by WFG helping families have better financial futures here's the draw to the button for hammer and you know what Tracy Fleury wasn't great but take a look at what happens to Yoshimura Neither one of them will be happy with uh, with the draw, but the Tracy Fleury will, will take the hammer happily. Big moment for Sayaki Yoshimura of Japan, 27-year-old. And we've got a great crowd here at the Memorial Gardens once again. Oldest member of the team, Yuni Funiyama, three-time Olympian, 41 years of age. They're all from Sapporo. But uh, both teams in a big game here will probably hit a, for a, an end or so just to get their feet under them. Jill, Kristen, McCush, very familiar to you. Mm -hmm. Yes, my niece. She was, or I was, I'm going to date myself here, but I was 17 when she was born. <laughs> How old is she, Scott? I'm not going to give her age. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> I'm good at math. I can do this game. I'm sure if people really wanted to, they could just look it up. <laughs> okay, she's 26. Okay. <laughs> yeah, they can do the math themselves. There you go. Actually had the first opportunity yeah. this year to play with Kristen. I filled in for Liz Fife while she was um, getting back on her feet after having her second child. So I played two events with Team Flurry uh, this year. We've always been competitors in the past number of years, so I was never able to play with her or even help her out or give her tips. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, family's one thing, but I'm not, I'm not helping you. No. Right? <laughs> Especially when she's a, a provincial rival for all those years when you're with uh, Team Jones. Different uh, weather conditions here today. A lot of rain this morning, so we'll see if uh, plays havoc with the ice. Spoke with uh, John Wall this morning, one of our ice makers, and he says it's cold rain. Usually doesn't affect things too much, but uh, certainly we'll be keeping an eye on things. They always do such a great job with the ice here at the Pinty's Grand Slam, and it was a beautiful, clear day yesterday. Overnight, a lot of rain. 
you know, Mark Shirk and his uh, team have always uh, managed to provide excellent conditions here. So interesting, now that the rock is off the forefoot area, they're going with the delayed corner here. We'll see how much Yoshimura wants to mix it up here. She could uh, potentially go around, or uh, if she's comfortable with nothing in place, she might just go up and peel the corner. Really curling. Liz Fife, uh, baby daughter Annika, born in July. Oh, it's Liz's second second child. She also has a daughter Lucy, who I believe is two. in Vancouver in 2010 for Japan. Uh, Yoshimura wants nothing to do with these corner guards right now. No. Could have let that stop. Partially guard her uh, stone in the rings. And now we're going to see Tracy hit. Could try to put up another corner guard and hope for a miss peel. Yep. Oh, quite a bit of whoa, weight. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 No, no. Yep. 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 Ah, good throw. They were trying to just roll a little bit to the outside to hide a little bit behind that that red guard, but uh, they missed the the sweep call yeah. just at the end. Ice is still a little bit fresh in the beginning of the game. Tough with that turn too to make that roll with the. Red corner guard, kind of in your mind's eye. Here's the third Keho Onodara, who played at the Olympics in Sochi in Selena Negevin curling 80 per 7 percent this week, so she's having a great Masters. Ooh, ooh. Okay, oh, <laughs> ooh, is right. <laughs> Just squeak by that corner guard. Well, and that's what you were talking about a couple of shots ago, Mike. Where playing that turn at it makes it a little bit trickier to get by that guard. Curling is a sport of statistics. Here's a look at the records of the teams when they do and do not have the hammer. Yoshimura without on the Grand Slam, Nine seven five. and six. Yep. Flurry with the hammer on the Grand Slam, 29 and 20. Yep. So the advantage goes to Flurry in this. Yeah, a little bit. That's a very good record without the hammer, though, for Yoshimura. There is, uh, okay. You're above 500 when you're starting the game without last rock. You're better than most. Well, Flurry certainly will be looking for a blank here at this stage. And Yoshimura will probably just play the hit on the nose on her first one, but I would think she'd try to roll behind that uh, wide corner guard on her last, see oh, okay. if she can get a force or a miss out of Team Flurry.
This one's really curling. I think we'll see Tracy go around the corner guard here now. Try yeah. and tuck a little piece. Hope for a miss. Well, let's take a look at the Boost head-to-head -head matchup brought to you by Boost. Complete nutrition to fuel your day. These teams have met four times. Yoshimura has the edge, three wins and a loss. On the Grand Slam, Yoshimura 2-0 and against Tracy Fleury, including a win at the Masters here in this season, 2-1, and again in favor of Yoshimura. You got it, Trace. Well, this could be the... Uh Sneaky two here. If Tracy can get one behind this wide corner guard, might uh, figure out a way to get uh, a second point here. Line's good. Close. Woo. No, we're close. Two lines. Close. Sliding good. Oh, lots needs of room. Needs to curl. Needs to curl a lot. Okay, that's good. T. I think she took probably a maximum ice. You Close never want to. Above T, though. You don't right need there. to play it tight to this guard, but it is you sort of finishing in here quite nice. Yep. Looks great. Yep, 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 shot. yep, 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 yep. Really nice. Yeah. Wow, what a nice shot. It's mostly buried, I would say. Probably mm -hmm. at least, oh, maybe almost okay. two-thirds buried. What was that? 14 one. That's a hard a hard shot for the, the sweepers to manage, too, because you don't have a lot of the rings to deal with way out on the side there. So they want to make sure, of course, that they're in, but they want to try to bury. Um, they could have taken it a couple inches deeper, but it was a really, really good job managing. As you say, make sure it's in the rings first. What a shot, um, forcing the run back here. Are you surprised she's playing the run back? That's just, I guess, a question of comfort, right? You can only see half the yellow, so. They know this turn. They've thrown this in turn out here wide a few times this end already. So take the one you know. It would be a bit of a guess to play the out turn hit. But, uh, it's a tougher shot than she was hoping to have. Both the teams began the season in August in Sapporo at the Hokkaido Bank Classic. And uh, this is the final stone for Sayaka Yoshimura in end number one. For shot, maybe. I don't think so. No, it does not. So. Um, they threw here. I got a 14. A very <laughs> surprising two ender here for Tracy Flurry. A really nice uh, skips deuce. You know, it's one of those uh, and such an innocent miss with. I got a 14-4 on their leads rock. I got a 14. Team Japan rolling out on yeah, uh, skips so first rock. Nice. Yoshima yeah, rolling away, and uh, all of a sudden, oh, two's yeah. in yeah, the sure, mix. Yeah. Think a little bit. Not for a you second it. did it look like yeah, a two-ender. Chance to get a big jump here. Final stone, end number one, and what looks like a free path Mine's for good. Tracy Fleury Close. to a two-ender in end number one. Not moving yet. Wait, there it goes. Can't hurt it. Yep. Hard. Got it. Hard, Tristan. Keep it moving. Hard. They're working it. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And she'll have enough. Great work by the sweepers. Make it two for Tracy Flurry as she gets the early jump at the Masters final. Some people see the world a little differently, where others see problems. Hmm. They see possibilities, and they have the curiosity and ingenuity to turn those light bulb moments into awesome realities. We know who you are. Pinty's Chicken Wings, just like you get at the pub. 
official sponsor of the Hamilton Tiger Cats, eight-time Grey Cup champs and kings of Steel Town, Pinty, making great food fun. At Coyote, we're going to treat you like dirt because we hold dirt in the highest regard. We're honored to find it under our fingernails, lucky to be caked in it at day's end. It keeps us humble, honest. Dirt gets taken for granted by most, but if you know us, you know getting treated like dirt means getting treated with respect. Coyote, we dig dirt. Brian has been riding to work every day since 1991, but it's not 1991 anymore. Brian could use Boost, a nutritional drink for when he's not getting enough in his diet to help him keep doing what he loves. Men's hair goes through a lot, so make sure it's ready for anything. Dove Men Plus Care Fortifying Shampoo, especially engineered for men, to leave your hair stronger and more resilient. Dove Men Plus Care. Help relieve nasal cold symptoms with Hydrosense. Its naturally sourced seawater is clinically proven to relieve nasal congestion, and you can use it alongside your other cold medications. Hydrosense. Breathe better with our signs of the sea. Some people see the world a little differently, where others see problems. Hmm. They see possibilities, and they have the curiosity and ingenuity to turn those light bulb moments into awesome realities. We know who you are. 2018 Women's World Championships, North Bay. Jennifer Jones versus Sweden's Anna Hasselberg. Jill, you played in it. It was a ton of fun. It was amazing. As you can see, the crowds here have, are, are just awesome. They're so supportive. They're very knowledgeable. And what a thrilling moment to, to have that here in North Bay. They were, the crowd and the community was way more than we ever could have expected. And it was a great way for me to finish my career. That's for sure. Another world championship for Jennifer Jones in a great match and a great crowd. Jennifer Jones said it was the loudest crowd she had ever played in front of. Absolutely great support for big time curling here in North Bay, Ontario. And wonderful crowds here for the Masters and the Pinty's Grand Slam of curling. Let's go to end number two, a surprise two for Tracy Fleury in end number one, so catch up time for Sayaka Yoshimura. I do, I do like how Jill refers herself as my last pit game. She played about three spiels this year, about five spiels last year. <laughs> Still on everyone's spare list, are you? With every, with different teams. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they say that old curlers never retire. That's true. That's true. Well, and it's true that I never actually used the R word. <laughs> Stepping away. Stepping away. That's, that's a very Manitoba thing. Kathy yeah. O did that too. I'm stepping away. Yeah. That was well swept yeah, to yeah, get yeah. over by okay, uh, top four. very little. I've seen that a few times this week. But it makes a difference, especially when you're down two. You don't hate to hog a guard and the end's well, almost over if you do that. Pretty close. I'm good, not moving much. Looks here. Yeah, it's not curling yeah. at all. We're back for yeah. back eight. 13 seven. It's really dying. Though. Yeah, it's coming. Sit. Good. Kill is. It's good. Sometimes, especially early in a game, when uh, you see the sweepers back off and they're calling for it to be back house, it just still catches some fresh pebble with no, having a broom in front of the rock. And uh, it can slow down yeah. like it, like we just saw there. Okay. Really quickly. Um. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Well, what a great roll. 
It's hard to call those, I think, because, you know, trying to roll to that exact perfect spot without over rolling. Got it. So the call's just hit this on the nose and exchange positions here. The key is trying to make sure your shot stone. It's a little on the outside and uh, Red will still be shot rock and will let Yoshimura split the rings. That is way out there. Hard, it's up. Hard, 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 hard. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Nine, two. A good opportunity here now Thank for you. Yoshimura to split the house. Need to get their two back. Mike, being in a final for the first time on the Grand Slam, you would think it would be an emotional time for Yoshimura's team. Would you characterize them as technically good shot makers? Yeah, I haven't seen them play a whole lot other than this event, to be honest. I saw them uh, maybe at a spiel last year when I was uh, coaching with the Chinese group, but. Uh, the nice thing for them, yes, it's a big deal to be in a Grand Slam final, don't get me wrong, but, you know, three of the players have been to the Olympics, so there's not much bigger stage than that. Um, so I don't think the moment's going to overwhelm them. Um, you know, again, being the only sheet out there, that's a big change. You know, when you're the only sheet out on the ice, a lot of times the conditions change a little bit. So that type of experience uh, is invaluable. And that's maybe where Team Flurry has a bit of an edge. You know, the front three on Team Flurry have won a slam with uh, Kerry Anderson, so... Um, they've been here before and have been successful before. But uh, Yoshi Murray, you kept, you know, I said, calling, or excuse me, Jennifer Jones in the semis, and then <laughs> Tiranzoni in the, er, in Jones in the quarters, Tiranzoni in the semis. If you can knock off those two teams, you're, uh, I don't think uh, the moment's going to be too big for them. You should be feeling pretty confident Just today, nine five. knowing that. shot they didn't they rolled to still be shot um just the nice controlled weight that they threw good sweep all that body weight on the brush head Kristen right up on her toes and simple simple shots are important you just have to hit and stay this is really curling. I think they're going to roll out. <laughs> and it was a simple rollout last time that cost them a point. And might be the same here. Sometimes just hitting and staying in the rings is the, the most important shot that you have to make in a game. Yeah, we're, that was one of my favorite uh, Wayne Madai-isms. You know, if you can hit and stay, and you can draw the eight foot, you can be a good curler. That's all it takes. Sounds simple, doesn't it? Yeah. Not always that easy. Absolutely not. Yep. 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 This one's really moving. I think Selena was a bit tight out of her hand. Not heavy right either. Over. And they're on that guard. Go, go, go. Right over, right over. Keep yep. going, keep going, keep going. Hard, 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 hard. Yeah, that, okay. that guard really wasn't in play much, okay, but kind of in your in your eye, mind's eye that's for sure now an yes. opportunity again for Yoshimura to have their two points set up for Keho Anadara, the third for Team Yoshimura. That's great weight. Perfect. Split the rings. Well, Tracy's going to try to hit that stone. We'll just throw and roll back into the middle and see if she can't group the stones and maybe have a double opportunity on her last. Do you think it'll go too crazy, hey? No, I don't think so. Okay. Here's a look at the uh, road to the final. Brought to you by Coyote. 
If you have work to do, Coyote has the tractors, UTVs, and ZRTs to do it. Coyote, we dig dirt. For Tracy Fleury, 3-1 and one in the round robin. And then she gets by Stern. And then Anna Hasselberg, 7-5 to five in the semifinal in order to advance versus Yoshimura. Uh, Tracy just threw two or three really fantastic shots against Hasselborg. Particularly in the sixth end, made a phenomenal draw. And Anna uncharacteristically missed a few uh, simpler shots that she would normally be a lot closer on. Yeah, a couple open hits, which is mm -hmm. weird for Anna. Absolutely. It's been a bit of, you know, the ice surface here just a ton of movement in it. So anything with a soft release, like we saw with Selena's hit in this end, it just curls sideways. So you have to be really consistent with your release to be good enough to make the shots here this week. The journey to the final for Sayaka Yoshimura. Her only loss, well, her one of her losses, 10-3 to Rachel Holman was the worst loss. And then in the playoffs, she defeated, as Mike was alluding to, some big names in Jennifer Jones and Silvana Tiranzoni, the world champion. So not intimidated in the least. Got to go to get by here. That's a really well swept. There's a bit of an angle here now for Tracy Flair. Just not sure she can throw it hard enough to get it all the way across the rings here. There's a good look at it. It's about a foot and a half higher, but you just got to whip this one to have a chance to move that red, second red out. We're going to try. There's also the option of more, just rolling over there, rolling over to try to get in it? front of it as a uh, shot rock. Yeah, similar to what uh, Yoshimura did here early in this end. And so now Yoshimura will have a free draw for two to get right back even with Flurry. Well, we've got a couple of, uh, we call them soft twos here so far in this game. They're really. I don't think it, I think with Peel, I don't Fairly think, yeah, easy miss it. by Yoshimura in the end number one, and then it was Selena in this end, direct on that guard. Kind of turned over. Two right back. I think I've conceded her the putt here, Scott. Uh, <laughs> she still has to make the draw, but well, I like her chances. Draw to the button, she missed the house. True enough. Sweepers, I think it's light. <laughs> yeah. Immediately went down. Really on it. Yeah, their head's down here. They're really working this. And now it's curling across the middle as well, which never helps. Oops. All the way they go. Yoshimura's sweepers. And they just get it there. Wow. There are no gimmies in curling. <laughs> Clearly. Those sweepers knew right away that she was light and that they couldn't hurt it, so they put their heads down and went the whole way. All tied up, Yoshimura and Flurry at the Masters. Venti's Chicken Wings, just like you get at the pub. Official sponsor of the NFL. Are you ready for some football? Venti's. Making great food fun.
innovation, style, and performance. The G50 has it all. I love the speed and comfort. And they're so light. Wow, this is light. It offers the choice of Teflon thickness. That's best for your level of playing. Beginner or pro? The G50 line has a shoe for you. The quality of the shoe is great. And they're really comfortable. Sleek. Stable. Secure. It's a gold line. 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 And it's the choice of champions. World Financial Group Canada believes that families deserve sound financial futures. Our independent financial professionals provide clients with a strategy to achieve their goals. Through World Financial Group Canada's affiliated companies, our licensed agents offer an array of financial products to help clients find the right product no matter where they are in life. If you're ready to prepare for your future, contact your local World Financial Group financial professional, helping Canadian families have better financial futures. Why would you invest in a market where commute times are long, housing is expensive, and growth is limited due to competition and location? Invest North Bay Development Corporation has a better idea for you. Invest where cap rates are better, commute times are shorter, growth and expansion is encouraged, and owning your own home is affordable. InBay, land your investment in our house. Thanks, and enjoy the curling. He's right. Ah! It is disgusting. It's nothing. It's a nail fungus infection. Ah, it's a monster! Ah, come on, it's not that bad. It's contagious. You can even spread it to other people. You should really get that checked out. We've got to kill the monster! It's nothing. It's an infection. You have to treat it. You need a prescription. Nail fungus should be taken seriously. At the first sign, show it to your doctor and ask about prescription treatments that can be applied to the nail. Scotiabank Wednesday Night Hockey on Sportsnet. Oilers, Blue Jackets, Wednesday, Sportsnet. Magic Raptors, tomorrow on Sportsnet 1. Well, do you want to watch the next event of this season's Pinty's Grand Slam of Curling in person? The Coyote Tractor Tour Challenge taking place at the Pictou County Wellness Center in Nova Scotia from November 5th to 10th. Tickets available at www.thegrandslamofcurling.com backslash tickets. Oh, and a little bit of music just before the draw. The North Bay Ukulele Club performing here at the Memorial Gardens. Listen to this. There is such a wonderful rhythm to this sport, isn't there? <laughs> I think we found a new theme song. 2-2, two, two, Yoshimura and Flurry after two. Deuces are wild, and here we go in at number three. Hey, life's good. Time works. Already got a few rocks in play here. The teams are feeling more comfortable with the ice. I think you're here. We're there. We're there. four. Might be able to a bit. I said both teams will probably yeah. think, well, I didn't really deserve two in the first end, and the I didn't really deserve two in the second end, but they're uh, tied now and uh, better feel of the ice, as you said, Jill. And time to go. Nice come around there by Kristen. So Yoshimura's team is going to try to follow her down, play freeze. sideways here at the end it, it hangs out there for quite a while and then really swoops in there good result so yoshimura put up the two guards but the 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 issue with these two guards is that they're not lined up properly and that's what leaves this double peel here for liz 
when you play the, the tight guard and the long guard, it's really important to get them lined up properly. Well, Sayaka Yoshimura getting some uh, coaching advice here. Let's go down to Kevin Martin, who's got Connor Negevin, who's doing some consulting work with Yoshimura and sort of splitting his allegiances, Kevin. Splitting his allegiances, I think so. But first of all, let's, uh, let's talk a little bit about how he got involved with Team Yoshimura. Yeah, we went out there to play an event in August, and they were looking for somebody uh, just to help them consult and get a little bit better. They had a really good year last year, and they were just trying to look to make the next step. So had a meeting with her out there in August, and it's, yeah, been going ever since. So I guess what, what would be your main responsibilities then in this team? I think it's just about consulting, kind of talking to them a little bit about the big events and, and how to prepare and what to game plan for and dealing with rocks and ice and different things like that. They have a full-time coach in Japan. Um, so basically, I'm just consulting, trying to make sure they're ready for every game they play. Well, yeah, so you're not spending a lot of time in, uh, in Japan but when they come over here. Um, part of your job as a consultant, would that be away from the ice, would be setting up team goals, things like that? Like what, what, what would be, uh, with a team like this, setting goals? Yeah, for sure. Looking at how they set goals and not only looking just at results, but how do we get better as we progress and how do we look at the world championship and things like that and make sure that we're always getting better every time we step on the ice. Um, just trying to get them set up so that they're always looking to improve all the time. Now, back to being a little bit torn here, you've got uh, your team, Team Yoshimura, but then your wife, of course, on the other team. How are you keeping that separate? It's really tough. You know what, honestly, I'm just, if you make a slam final, you're playing really good. And I'm just really, really proud of, like, both teams. It's a really cool experience. Obviously, Selena and their team have had a really good year, and they work so hard. And my girls are really looking up to them as a team they want to emulate and be like. And it's just, uh, it's a really cool experience for me. Well, thanks a lot. I'll get, uh, let you get back to business. Thank thanks, you. Connor. Thank you. Hey, Kevin, great stuff. And uh, really an enlightening chat with Connor Negevin and it points out the fact that even in this day and age when things are getting more competitive that it's still a very collaborative sport we're still growing okay. curling in many ways across the world well there's coaching the coaches working you know Canadian coaches working all over the world and uh, you know I'm working with the Swiss women's team this year for example and uh, I know that uh, it's really appreciated, I think. Uh, the nice thing when you're working with teams from foreign countries, they really appreciate the experience that Canadians bring to the, to the sport. So it's a great opportunity for, uh, for many of our uh, Canadian coaches. Ian Tetley's here working with the Scots again, and uh, yeah, it's, it's been good. So um, interesting story with uh, Hiroshi Sato there on the left-hand side. That's the Japanese coach. Uh, curled against Hiroshi in the 1998 Olympics. He played third for the Japanese men's team, and he's been working with this team for a few years. And, uh, you know, again, recognizing that uh, bringing someone on with a kind of a fresh perspective on things is important for, for the team. So um, it's, uh, it was nice to reunite with him a couple years ago. And he knows the game very well also. He's been coaching for many, many years. Meantime, we're getting deep into end number three. In a tie game. Yeah, at this point, you know, again, Yoshimura is just looking to continue to hit and stay and try not to leave a double for Flurry to get out of the end. So, in the simple shots, love to roll away to the other side of the house here and try to force Tracy Flurry into taking a single point. Tracy certainly can hit <laughs> that wide stone. I think the top one will stay out of the rings if they hit it on the center line side. Nine. Okay. You got it. Yeah, I'm not surprised that, that Tracy's choosing to do this. I mean, they could they could play a come around on it as well, but... She'd love a blank end here. Get the hammer in the even ends. Similar to N1, doesn't it? The other side of the sheet. So again, 
Yoshimura, don't roll out. Yeah. You say it sound, sounds simple, but okay. if you can hit and stay, yeah. keep play away. Don't let Tracy Fleury get around that corner guard. Down to skip rocks now, and here is the first for Sayaka Yoshimura, three-time Pacific Asia Junior Champion, and now making an impression in the senior ranks. Inside out shots, they seem to really be moving to the wings today, and the teams aren't quite catching it. Yeah, it was nice here. Again, Do you think similar to what she threw? Opportunity for this soft like for two, we there. call it, just yeah. or a little better. And giving points away. She's looking at her rock back yeah, there. I don't think she likes it very much. Similar to what you threw yeah. She's yeah. missed yeah. with that stone twice one. already. I would get even if better. even yeah. if you really aren't girl, sure, so get rid of it. Okay, just in front. You got it. Okay, you got it, Trace. The sweepers were trying to make it so perfect, but I mean, that's pretty, that's pretty good close. Enough. Yeah. <laughs> they're not they're not playing against Kevin Cooey. Correct. That would even be tough for Kevin, I think. Mm -hmm. Hard curled lot. Mm -hmm. I heard mm -hmm. Kristen say that it curled a lot, so I think that's why they got caught on the speed. Yeah, Sometimes when it you know when it does curl a lot, the speed can slow down on it. But you heard the sweepers talking the whole way down and communicating about what they thought, and that was a great job in managing the shot. The last for Sayaka Yoshimura here in end number three cannot afford another miss and open the door too wide for Tracy Flurry. Limiting damage here. Well, again, just hit and stay, Scott. I mean, if they can hit and stay, trying to make sure that uh, Tracy, I mean, it's going to be an open hit, but you know, the damage was done on her first one. Missed, uh, there's been very few hits this week missed wide. Most of them have been a little tight and uh, over curling. You got it, Trace. You got it. Just make sure you get out to the brush. Last rock of end number three for Tracy Flurry and a chance to score Time two. Go. Okay, wait, it's nice. Kristen. Kristen, you gotta go. Go, 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 Good. And they're right on it. And there are the two for yellow. Flurry doubles up on Yoshimura. 4-2 after three at the Masters in North Bay. World Financial Group Canada believes that families deserve sound financial futures. Our independent financial professionals provide clients with a strategy to achieve their goals. 
Through World Financial Group Canada's affiliated companies, our licensed agents offer an array of financial products to help clients find the right product no matter where they are in life. If you're ready to prepare for your future, contact your local World Financial Group financial professional. Helping Canadian families have better financial futures. Every day you go new places. A small change in how you do things, or moving your things to a whole new town, or many things to many towns, all at once. No matter how small the move, it can be a big leap from where you are now. You've got it in you to go new places. So do we. We go there every day. We're here to help you move to places on the map, in the mind, in the heart, or all three. Go new places with AMJ Campbell. Contact us at 888-AMJ-MOVE or amjcampbell.com. Pinty's Chicken Wings, just like you get at the pub. Official sponsor of the NFL. Are you ready for some football? Pinty's, making great food fun. At Rogers, we believe in the power of youth. It's why we created Ted Rogers Scholarships, to support more team builders, more community leaders, more difference makers. With Ted Rogers Scholarships, now in its third year, we're continuing our commitment to the next generation so they can reach their full potential and create a future where anything is possible. Men's hair goes through a lot, so make sure it's ready for anything. Dove Men Plus Care Fortifying Shampoo, especially engineered for men, to leave your hair stronger and more resilient. Dove Men Plus Care. It's not what it used to be. It's not just a couple guys we have to look out for. It's everyone. They're all great. So it's not just about how good we can get as individuals. It's about how good we can be together to find the right person for each position and the right tool for every job it's more than a winning combination it's a solution gold line the choice of champions welcome back to the pinty's grand slam of curling and the masters from north bay ontario ominous skies in the downtown of this northern ontario city been raining throughout the day but we're nice and cozy inside the memorial gardens and part of the story here at the masters in 2019 kevin martin has been the play of 24 year old matt dunstone who was great in the semi against bruce moat again well look at that yes it goes through that hole but it's barely bigger than a rock <laughs> and i just you know you, you gotta love youthful energy like that to uh, Matt has been putting on a show. He's a highlight reel every game, and that was just another one. That was in the fourth end. Here are the Coyote Blake uh, playoff bracket brought to you by Coyote. If you have work to do, Coyote has the tractors. UTVs, ZRTs to do it. Coyote, we dig dirt. In the semifinals, it was Dunstone over Bruce Moe at 5-4. And then Brad Gushu defeated John Epping, the defending champion here at the Masters, 7-5 in the other semi. So it will be Dunstone Gushu in the final. And that's coming from North Bay, Ontario. The Grand Slam of Curling, the Masters, the first stone set to head down the ice, 4.30 p.m. Eastern, 1.30 p.m. Pacific on Sportsnet East, Ontario and Pacific. Meantime, we're contesting the Women's Championship at the Masters. And it is 4-2 after three ends of play for Tracy Fleury over Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan. As Mike Harris likes to say, soft twos in the first three ends. Yeah, really uncharacteristic misses late in ends that led to three consecutive easy two-enders for the team with the hammer. So, you know, Tracy Fleury will be trying to avoid the same fate here in end number four. Threw one in the forefoot to start. Yoshimura hit it and rolled to the wings. And then, then uh, Tracy hit the one at the back 12 over there on the right. Then Yoshimura threw the guard. That's how we got here. Liz was just trying to throw a tight guard there because they still want to bring the play to the middle, but a little heavy, so this leaves an opportunity for Yoshimura to make a hit and roll. Again, 
Sounds easy, doesn't it? Just hit and stay. <laughs> that seems to be a bit of a challenge today in some spots. And uh, the result is it's uh, going to kind of put the end in jeopardy here now for Yoshimura. Tracy Flurry with two point lead. We'll just go up and peel that corner guard. Stuck around a little bit. It could be useful later in the end. Guard is the call here. Again, the teams are just getting caught on that inside out. They're really curling and hey, you can almost consider curling playing the other turn there, right? Seen, I think. That, uh, does potentially bring a jam into play, but <laughs> here's that opportunity again with uh, miss from Selena. And get around the this tight guard. Chance to score two. First to the end for Keho Onodara. And a chance to make something happen for her team to get it back in this game with Tracy Fleury. Sweepers on it again. The Rock is moving. Just a little light, if anything, and roll to a good spot, though. Tracy's got to deal with that stone. Another ounce of weight there would have got by. <laughs> Tracy being aggressive going right around here. Two point lead. Well, the, the, the logic here is if, you, if we hit this on the nose, that red one, if you're Tracy Flurry, they're going around. So she's going to try to beat them to the punch. It's always dangerous leaving those rocks so close to the rings up the middle of your opponents. Top four only. Okay, you have to finish. Hi, right, Kristen, you gotta finish. Wade's great. Keep going, Kristen. Wade's really good. He's really out there. It's moving a little bit now, but they did take quite a bit of ice. We want to make sure that well, they're. <laughs> can't afford to rob that. Right yeah, and they're, I was just gonna say, they can't, you gotta make sure that you're by. Probably edge to edge, but uh, the way it moves here, they can make the roll in behind that center guard. just hit and stay out in the side of the 12 foot oh. flurry would almost have to hit it and uh, would let them go around that middle but uh, with the roll out flurry can try to get one buried here and they just saw this spot so now they're taking a little bit less ice for for tracy to hopefully actually get behind the guard this time 14 five's close to t here yeah i think this was a 14 two yeah maybe 14 three four 
touch with the girl. You got it, Trace. You got it. Skip Stones as we approach the midway point of the match. Flurry with the lead by two and creating opportunities here. Yeah, line! Top four! You gotta go line! Come on, Liz. Don't think Tracy quite got oh, out to the berm on that one. Wait's good. Wait's good! Sweepers and it's wow. just <laughs> what a great job sweeping. My goodness. Here's another look. Yeah, Selena said tight right out of out of Tracy's hand, and they worked this the whole way. Thankfully, she had decent weight that they could afford to sweep it that whole way. She did slip a little bit deep, but the important thing was to get it by. Yeah, it's not behind the T-line, though, is it? Right on the T-line. And look at that thing finish. Yoshimura forced to play the run back here. And if this is not made and Flory throws a okay. decent shot on her next one, it's going to be very difficult to score for Team Yoshimura. <laughs> Just off nose. We'll do it. First for Yoshimura. Crowd completely silent before the delivery. And uh, punched it right through the middle of those two yellow stones. So now, big trouble. It looked like she just pushed it wide a little bit. And the third tried to call for to hit the one at the back of the house. But unfortunately, they just went through the hole. Well, if Tracy can get one into this position right here, where there's no way to draw the side of the button, should be forced to play a double. 14 5 was your last one. And to give up a single point here. So uh, the key here for Tracy is keep it a little bit on the center line side, on, to, on the right side of center. And block off the draw. If the, if the guard's a little higher and more more to the directly in front of the stone, Yoshimura will play the draw to the side of the button. That's no bargain either, but she would have a chance to score. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, Wait's close. Okay, line time. Mine's good. Top 12. Top 12. Okay. Need to curl a little. No deeper than top 12. Look here. I'm under there. Where a nose hit would leave a... It's full 12. 15 one, just full 12. No, 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 it needs no, to stop. No, we're all there, we're all there. We're all there. Sit. Good. Trouble right there. <laughs> right where you put the rock? Where the circle was? <laughs> I think that's exactly where you marked it, Mike. <laughs> I don't know that uh, you, Yoshimura can score. Maybe an outside just shot of a, of a run triple, maybe? They're going to try to come around that to the side of the button. That's pretty tough. Yeah. I don't know what else you play, though. I guess if you can, first thing in your mind if you're going out wide here is make sure you get to the full eight foot, only give up one. If the line's perfect, then you try to get to the, I don't know, sure if you can see the, the, put, the button or not, or you'd have to move that yellow stone an inch or two. But what a great shot, two great shots from Tracy Fleury. Great judgment by the front end as well. Well, I was going to say well managed by the sweepers on both of those shots. Mind you, on Tracy's first one, they didn't have much choice. They <laughs> end to end. End to end. But well managed on the second one to put it in a really good place. Ooh, it's 
sweepers who picked this one up early. Yeah, eight foot first. This is really out there. They're going to need to get some finish out of this if they're going to be close. I was say, make sure they cut them down to one. And I don't think that's going to move enough, but you had to throw that shot that way. Limits the damage and only gives up a steal of one as Tracy Fleury now takes command over Sayaka Yoshimura at the Masters in North Bay. There are better known tractors in the world than Coyote. Ones with bigger names, longer histories, more popular hats, cute toy lines. But there's not a single tractor ever been built that's better equipped to do the dirty work. So we'll let the others keep their squeaky clean images. And we'll focus on what really matters. Coyote, we dig dirt. Pinty's Chicken Wing, just like you get at the pub. Official sponsor of the Calgary Flames, Western Conference Warriors, and Heroes in Cowtown. Finty's making great food fun. Every day you go new places. A small change in how you do things, or moving your things to a whole new town, or many things to many towns all at once. No matter how small the move, it can be a big leap from where you are now. You've got it in you to go new places. So do we. We go there every day. We're here to help you move to places on the map, in the mind, in the heart, or all three. Go New Places with AMJ Campbell. Contact us at 888-AMJ-MOVE or amjcampbell.com. Men's hair goes through a lot, so make sure it's ready for anything. Dove Men Plus Care Fortifying Shampoo is specially engineered for men to leave your hair stronger and more resilient. Dove Men Plus Care. He's right. Ah! It is disgusting. It's nothing. It's a nail fungus infection. Ah, it's a monster! Come on, it's not that bad. It's contagious. You can even spread it to other people. You should really get that checked out. We've got to kill the monster! It's nothing. It's an infection. You have to treat it. You need a prescription. Nail fungus should be taken seriously. At the first signs, show it to your doctor and ask about prescription treatments that can be applied to the nail. of all this helpful stuff make a phone you get something that you can use without even having to touch it you get a google assistant that gets it all done fast helps you get the perfect photo even in the dark you even get the stars introducing a phone made the google way google pixel 4 Curling is a sport for all ages. The Little Rockers took to the ice here at the North Bay Memorial Gardens earlier today, getting their throws in. And then it was the Junior Grand Slam of Curling, featuring boys and girls from the North Bay Granite Club, taking advantage of some instruction from Nekadeen, the world champion of Sweden. And then some more women's teams from the Isle Wild uh, Golf and Country Club and the Sudbury Country Club invaded North Bay. Big day of curling here at the Memorial Gardens at the Masters. And we are in the women's final after four ends of play. Tracy Flurry has a commanding lead over Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan. 5-2. Still time to come back for the Japanese rink. Well, she was tied without the hammer late against Tiranzoni yesterday and uh, going in six then and end up stealing three. So they're dangerous uh, once they decide to get some rocks and play. The challenge right now for Yoshimura is they're just uh, 
So they're missing the easy ones. You know, missing those that are, like I said, hit and rolling out when they need to stay and missing the rings when they need to kind of get it in play. So, um, you know, need to kind of clean up what's going on on the ice. And for the most part, Team Flurry is capitalizing on those those misses, those opportunities. A little more. Mine goes! Close! Four. Yep! Roll it. Mine good! Yeah, good. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's fine! Wait's good! Oh, you're by. Wait's wait, oh, close. Oh, you're there, right there. Oh, no, 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 no. T-line. Mine's great. Shots on. 13-8. Very nice. And roll the five rock rule. They could throw another corner guard if they want it. Down, down three here in the fifth end. Reluctant to just move that stone at the top of the rings yes, out. Yes. Just have to stay. Yeah, and the key here is, is to stay, but they would really like to roll that shooter behind the corner, which is not going to happen. They're over curling already. Bumping it behind the corner is not bad, though. That yellow one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Use that later. It's okay. Roll. Ten. I like the theory. Just keep rocks yeah, in play. Yeah. Good look at us. You could actually freeze down to that one, Scott, at the back twelve, and use the corner guard. Good spot. Ten. Oh, oh. Oh. Well. Spike with a nice shot here. Three yellow in the rings. Good sweep. Nice throw. Okay, come on. Oh, come on. With that uh, rock at the back of the house. Yoshimura is playing the draw. Going huh? around the corner guard. Well, here's the way things have unfolded so far. The game repack, recap brought to you by Princess Auto, helping you make it work. Tracy Flurry hit for two in the third end uh, to take the lead by two. And then Sayaka Yoshimura had to hold her to a steal of one with a nice draw in the fourth. There are the percentages right now. Flurry slightly ahead of Yoshimura, 79 to 77%. Five, two, Flurry after four. Well, they peeled the guard away, and Yoshimura okay. going to play the freeze now down to that back yellow. That will leave a run on that top red one straight back, though. They can get it frozen to that back one, though. It will, in a, in a good position, it will make it difficult to play the run back. They can freeze right to the nose of it. There it goes. Ooh. <laughs> A lot of late movement. It's on the center one, most of the way down, just at the very end did it curl enough. It's not a terrible spot there. Flurry's going to play the back one. Take a run of that red, red double gel. What, what would you like there? Um, yeah, you could. I, I, I don't think it's necessary. I think this makes sense. I just think that you want to make sure to roll the, yeah. the shooter yeah. away. Even if you double your own off Bye. at the back of the house, it just Bye. means that they have nothing to draw to. Okay. It's also not a bad plan B. Kill one of the reds and 
You gotta kind of play that out turn freeze now, I think. There it is. I think Selena was just tight right out of her hand. They had Liz on it right away. It's too bad that they touched their, their rock in that was on the T-line, just to move it back enough to open it up for Yoshimura to play this freeze. Yeah, you saw the front ends had uh, all had pretty good numbers here, and you're going to see the back end as Onondera down at 64. And Yoshimura will be similar, I would think, so that's how the, uh, that's where the difference has been so far. This looks good, though. Very nice. Critical for Yoshimura to get back in the game in this end number five. Definitely needs to score here, Scott, and uh, two would be two would be great. You can try. <coughs> you can try. Okay. Um, so we're talking going red, yellow, and having a chip back into the red on the left. But uh, you heard Tracy say likely we'll just jam on the wide one. So just even if you pick this clean, it's pretty good shot. Not touching it. Yeah, back one, yes! Right on the mark. Well, plan B again, hitting that back one. Yoshimura can just dead freeze on the nose here on that red again. You know, three might be in the mix. A couple of uh, little minor misses from Selena there. It's had the good, decent results, but has opened up an opportunity here for Yoshimura. Mm, the sweepers are backing off a little bit of this one. Much wider and uh, a little heavy. Looks heavy. Just don't leave a double if you're red. Right just heavy the whole way. Okay. Not bad. Could have been worse. The fact that it's in play is uh, gives it a chance. Or we freeze. I don't mind the freeze. Okay. The Fine. thirds, both uh, Onodara and Nagavin, have struggled a little bit today. Yeah, neither one of them are necessarily capitalizing on the other's misses. That was a good opportunity for Yoshimira's team to capitalize on Selena's miss. get a hair to the inside. I like it. The spot's getting quicker. Five, yeah. Five, We've five, had two five, or three draws five, down here. Four, and that's quite often the difference that you pointed out there yesterday, Jelly. You know, once one side of the sheet kind of stays quiet for a few minutes, it tends to tighten up a bit. But no, we've had this is the third draw now in this spot. And it should be pretty quick here. So tough to get the weight right here. And hard to leave this in an angle where Yoshimura can't use it either. spot at least I'm call a timeout they're looking at uh, nose hit this one onto a piece of that maybe kill these back two and the yellow would go out the side here and their shooter would stay right up top. The other option is the intern draw. Problem is, Flurry can easily run the yellow that she just threw in. 
Here comes Hiroshi. Hiroshi does all the timeouts. Connor will give him a, an opinion of what to do before he walks out. ノーズか。ノーズ。赤だけは確かに。おお。どうだ。もう向こうから見てこのドローしかないように見えるけどな。うん。あ、それが何かあるか。何あるかなって今。これやられてしゃあないよな。あ、こっちがノーズする。あ
hope the line's right. For sure. Sweeper. For sure, yeah. Looks like there's room. They're probably about three square inches to draw to here, Scott. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no pressure on the sweepers here. Anytime there's room, there's room. That's right. Uh, I've seen shots like this made before. Your, uh, your old skip made a few of these. <laughs> well, you, you made a few of these for your old yes. skip, I should say. Combination. That's the right way to say it, isn't it, Joe? <laughs> Sitting beside the sweeper. Last rock in five, Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan trying to get that much closer to her rival Tracy Flurry. Sweepers all over it now. The weights in the ballpark. Looks close. Wow, does it ever. It's starting to move. Starting to move. This is not quite enough. Just a hair short. What a great attempt. One more look. The sweepers got off of it just for a sec here. Yeah, well that just, if they just stayed on it the whole way, may have had a chance. Very, very close to two. She'll take the one. Yoshimura will. And it's now 5-3 for Tracy Fleury after five ends of play at the Masters in North Bay. Company bonus. Company bonus. Number one employee? At least you're not number two. Seriously. Some rewards are better than others. Download Humpty's Guest Rewards app from the App Store or Google Play and get one point for every dollar spent for future discounts. Humpty's Guest Rewards. Reward yourself today. Some people see the world a little differently, where others see problems Hmm. They see possibilities, and they have the curiosity and ingenuity to turn those light bulb moments into awesome realities. We know who you are. Pinty's Chicken Wings, just like you get at the pub. Official sponsor of the Hamilton Tiger Cats. Eight-time Grey Cup champs and kings of Steel Town. Pinty, making great food fun. Men's hair goes through a lot. So make sure it's ready for anything. Dove Men Plus Care Fortifying Shampoo, especially engineered for men, to leave your hair stronger and more resilient. Dove Men Plus Care. Red alert, it's a gross big toenail! He's right. <laughs> It is disgusting. It's nothing. It's a nail fungus infection. Ah, it's a monster! Come on, it's not that bad. It's contagious. You can even spread it to other people. You should really get that checked out. We've got to kill the monster! It's nothing. It's an infection. You have to treat it. You need a prescription. Nail fungus should be taken seriously. At the first sign, show it to your doctor and ask about prescription treatments that can be applied to the nail. At Rogers, we believe in the power of youth. It's why we created Ted Rogers Scholarships, to support more team builders, more community leaders, more difference makers. With Ted Rogers Scholarships, now in its third year, we're continuing our commitment to the next generation so they can reach their full potential and create a future where anything is possible. There is 33-year-old Tracy Fleury, born and bred in Sudbury, Ontario, now curling out of the East St. Paul Curling Club in like Manitoba. It. And Tracy's had some success in the Grand Slam of curling. Been to two finals, 2015 the National, lost 5-4 to Rachel Holman, and lost again to Rachel Holman at the 2018 Tour Challenge, 8-4 that time. 
And Tracy, as we mentioned, uh, is from the Northern Ontario region. She took her team to the Big Nickel in Sudbury. By the way, she works at Laurentian University in Sudbury in the Business Administration Department. So she's got big time ties to Northern Ontario and the crowds behind her just a little bit here. There is her mom, Tish Horgan. She's all happy to be here at the Memorial Gardens. And her hu husband, Brent Fleury, is also <laughs> in attendance today. Hi, Brent. How you doing? Good to see Tracy here in the final yeah, of the weight. Masters. Yeah, chasing I I a Penty's Grand yeah. Slam of Curling title and has a lead right now. 5-3 over Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan after five ends of play. This is Pivotal, the sixth. This is a big end last night in the semifinals for Yoshimura. Said she was playing Tiranzoni, tied without, and was in all kinds of trouble. Made a great shot, ended up stealing three in that uh, sixth end. So she'd love to replicate that. Not sure Tracy will allow as many rocks in play as, as Sylvana did in that tie game. Of course, different story here. Tracy's two up. I definitely don't think Tracy's going to allow that many rocks in play. They, we've already seen them play the tick shot twice on on lead shots and Kristen made a great tick on the first one rolled her shooter into the house the yellow one you see on the left of your screen and she uh, missed the the second tick so the rock had to go to go back and that's the one we see Liz peeling now It's like Thanks. the Brent and Tish are down in the pinchy spot a having a beverage son. watching Maybe the game. A little bit of nerves take, probably. Take the edge off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great viewing area here at all our Grand Slams. Right in the action at ice level. This Japanese team very well supported commercially back in Japan. They're the Hokkaido Bank Fortius team, of course, the Olympic motto, Sidious Altius Fortius. Japanese sport, very well supported in terms of a corporate sponsorship. And that's the same message with this team from Sapporo. Yeah, I, I've spoke to uh, J.D. Lind, who coaches uh, Fujisawa's team, the uh, bronze medalists, and he was telling me they're just, they're legit superstars in Japan. And... Uh, you know, we, we, we love getting a couple million people watching yeah. our games here in Canada. They're talking 50 to 80 million people watching curling games in Japan. So they are, as you say, Scott, it's a, it's a big deal over there. They love their athletes. Well, you know, the Olympics in Tokyo next summer, already ticket sales have gone beyond any previous Olympics. Amazing. So the stadiums will be full. And it's, as you say, Mike, uh, the Japanese love high performance sport. Winter and summer. There's Team Tiranzoni. Okay, got it. Silvana Tiranzoni, the world champion. They uh, lost in the semifinal to Sayaka Yoshimura last night. 7 4 was the score. Great champions, of course. That is a very good team. Chatting with Silvana, they're going to put a few air miles on. They're flying home to Switzerland for a week before they head back to pick two for our next slam in about 10 days. So. I know some of, some of the Europeans are going home and some of them are hanging out in Canada. I've talked to a few that decided to stay rather than dealing with the travel there and back. Well, I got that stone at the top of the rings now. I think if you're uh, Yoshimura, we're down to thirds last. They need to make the guard here. They said it's... Uh, 
Don't want to slip into the rings here and leave a double on that easy two. Oh, this looks a little tight. Pretty good. Kay. Yeah, oh yeah, it's slowed down, not bad. Little Tracy, I... I'm going into the yellow. Really, yeah. It's going yeah, it's onto there, there, but I think yeah. that's okay. Kay. Make sure they score here in end number six here, Tracy say. Hey, Selena, you got it. Really, they just want to open this up in the middle to give them that opportunity to score. to hit their yellow one on the side, but it was a bonus actually that they, that the red one rolled out as well. Yeah, it was, uh, as you say, if that stays in the rings, it's an easy force for Yoshimura. As it is, they'll uh, try to go around the corner guard that was left. A little bit of a sigh of relief there from <laughs> Selena Negevin too. She had been struggling just a bit. Comes up with a nice big shot. Yeah, certainly takes the the steel out of the equation here. Taking the curl here. A little heavy. A little heavy. Mm -hmm. And they'll get it right out of the rings. So there's a miss for Yoshimura. Yeah. She's just struggling a bit with draw weight today. She's been a little bit all over yeah. the map yeah. and was light early and now has been heavy on her last few. Okay. I just had a 13.5. Yeah, it yeah. really slid really nice. Pretty good here. Probably yeah. 14. Yeah, 14. This five, is similar six. ice to what yeah. she just took. Yeah. Kay. You got it, Trey. You got it. We can afford a little more ice. Do you like a little more? Just wiggle the broom if you're you Selena. <laughs> you let, her, let her throw where she wants. See, you move the broom an inch on ice that moves as much isn't uh, isn't a big deal. Tracy will just want to make sure that she doesn't come close to the guard. There's no need to come close to that guard. She just wants to make sure she can get it in the rings, maybe bury a piece of it. We're close. Top eight. She Mine's gets good. it fully buried. Yeah, Great. A little bit. Mine's fine. Wait, good. Mine's fine. The key here yeah, really just burying an eight. inch of it, make We're sure they there. can't roll buried. We're all there. Mine's good. It's heavy. It's no, it's no, it's heavy. Line. No, 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 no. It's heavy. It's back. Really curly. It's no, okay, it's, it's all there. Can't. Great line. Probably uh, two feet deep. Okay, okay. Okay, so leave a chance for Yoshimura to play a freeze and, and make sure that they force. And this is where one. we've seen can I go talk about it again? It's got the soft twos where. Again, all you need to do if you're Yoshimura is get this a little bit buried and get shot stone. Doesn't have to be a perfect freeze. And Flurry will just draw for her one. Important shot here. Stay in this game. Don't want to be down four. Series of missed opportunities earlier in the game. Can't afford to miss this chance to put a little bit of pressure on Chasey Fleury. Yoshimura is last here in six. Definitely tighter line. 
Baker Wade is closer. They've had a broom on it the whole way. They can't really working it, there. just getting it by. Wow. What a great shot. Very nice. Needed that one. And got it. They were able to sweep this one or have a broom on it most of the way. It was on and off and came in there really nice, followed Tracy right down for a great shot. A little bit, yeah, but 13 and I'll probably Yeah, I think like a 14 two. It's your goal for Yoshimura now with the fourth. Try to get two and seven and steal coming home. Two or more in seven. And we've seen it before with five rock rule. Last stone of the sixth end for Tracy Fleury. Fine, kid. Close. I'd like to go. Okay, I think it's fine. It looks close. I think we can go. Forced to score wheels. here. Not moving yet. Okay, there it goes. Sliding good. Keep it broom no, down. Keep the eight. Yeah, keep going. Can't hurt it. And looks to have the weight. Good. And they'll bring it right to the prescribed spot. The bottom. And so, Tracy Fleury now leads 6-3 over Yoshimura as we head to end number seven. Company bonus. Company bonus. Number one employee? At least you're not number two. Seriously. Some rewards are better than others. Download Humpty's Guest Rewards app from the App Store or Google Play and get one point for every dollar spent for future discounts. Humpty's Guest Rewards. Reward yourself today. Some people see the world a little differently, where others see problems. Hmm. They see possibilities, and they have the curiosity and ingenuity to turn those light bulb moments into awesome realities. We know who you are. Being a world-class curler means you have to travel the world. It's time away from family and friends. And it can be a grind. But since we've got Goldline on our team, our gear is one thing we never have to worry about. So we can enjoy all the places we go together. Just a little bit more. Goldline, the choice of champions. He's right. It is disgusting. It's nothing. It's a nail fungus infection. Ah, it's a monster! Come on, it's not that bad. It's contagious. You can even spread it to other people. You should really get that checked out. We've got to kill the monster! It's nothing. It's an infection. You have to treat it. You need a prescription. Nail fungus should be taken seriously. At the first signs, show it to your doctor and ask about prescription treatments that can be applied to the nail. Brian loves cycling especially the hills. He's been riding his bike to work up the infamous Humbercrest Hill every day since 1991. But it's not 1991 anymore. Brian could use a bottle of Boost, a nutritional drink with protein, vitamins, and minerals for when he's not getting enough in his diet to help him keep doing what he loves. country thrilling to the beat of the Humpty's scramble the Memorial Gardens in North Bay Ontario 
And still to come, it's the men's final of the Masters. Curling out of Regina, 24-year-old Matt Dunstone. He's been hot. He'll take on Newfoundland and Labrador's Brad Gushu, 4.30 p.m. Eastern, 1.30 Pacific on Sportsnet East, Ontario, and Pacific. That shapes up to be a great match and hoping to create a match that will go down to the eighth end for decision is Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan trailing Tracy Flurry six to three. We're into the seventh. Pretty good weight on both of Kristen's shots here, but her second one didn't curl quite as much and she's left they've left them side by side here which is a good opportunity for Yoshimira to draw one to the pocket maybe eventually but right now they're going to focus on going around the or throwing another car in a guard pardon me <laughs> talk about come around the five rock rule i think you, you need to throw the second corner down three here in the seventh good call and then uh, we'll see what Tracy might be wise to come right down into that pocket herself. Or at least move them around a little bit. Yeah. Okay. yeah she's going to take away the pocket, hopefully try to take it away anyway. Heavy. They might want to try to just bump this right on the nose so that Needs to curl they though. can, yeah. Okay. Good. Hey. Yeah, that yeah, okay. it works. Yoshimura just try to nudge that on the nose and stay frozen, I think, is uh, the plan. I think I'd be tapping the other one. Yeah, there we go. I, I agree. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's the problem, Stone. It's going to take at least two shots to get rid of that one that's frozen. So tap it on the nose and hopefully stay dead locked on. And I think we'll probably see Flurry start peeling corner guards. Three up. Curling quite a bit already. Yes. Yes. Right hand one, if if at all. Not great. Roll back in front. Sorry. Roll back in front. Yeah. Nine five. Okay. I'll roll back to the guards. middle. I think Yoshimura's got to hit something. <laughs> so it's going to take a while to get rid of all those stones. It's getting very congested in there. Tracy Fleury looks to build the kill. The only thing with Liz tapping that other yellow one over is it leaves a, a double in the middle to and ha for Yoshimura to just leave their shooter right in front of one of the other yellow ones. Yeah, make the double on the top two yellows. You stay right in front of that stone on the button. And I like this call. Me too. Quite thin, the double, to stay there. Like that. Very nice. Deadlocked. And lined up to get rid of both of those yellow ones by hitting it on the nose. 
fantastic shot. They hit it thin enough that they came off almost the back of the other one and just spun in a little bit to be frozen. You couldn't have placed it any better. Will Connor come out and help? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Well, I just don't want to make anything for them. Like, they still need not to... Not carrying a coach here yeah, this week. They've had a couple of their uh, yeah. Curling Canada people um, watching them play a bit, but uh, no one officially can get out on the ice there with them. I think so. I think. One rock too early. What else do you like? Well, we could peel a, a guard. Yeah. Oh, but and then they jiggle, and you should be able to pick something. Yeah, I that's hate too. Like, you don't hit it right on the nose. They have one in the ring, <coughs> and they have two. Yeah. Yeah, I don't mind the, I don't mind the peel then. But then I guess we get it on the next one. Yeah, I'm just not sure they're playing around the corners right now anyways. Yeah. Like, they're probably just playing with this. Jig yeah, right? for sure, yeah. Well, but, but can they, they would if we make this for them, they'll yeah. use the corners. Yeah, like if yeah, we, if like, we true. miss it. Yeah, true. I don't, yeah, I don't mind that. They have to, they have to put their rock in a good spot. Yeah, make them Jiggling. make a good one. So peel this one? Or which one? This one? I don't think it matters. Do you think it matters? They're just kind of burning a shot no. here, I think, at the end of the day. Probably you heard uh, Liz, great op yeah, observation, because I don't okay. think they're going to play around the corners with this Either situation one. in the middle. I was just thinking if are you on? hit and roll like And Tracy says, well, like, if we, if we, <laughs> if we take our own two yellows out, they will. So I, I like this call. It's good at anything. What do you think, Jill? Uh, I, I completely agree. I, feel like okay. this is easier. I think if they play something around the middle, like they said, they're they're just kind of making it e a little easier for them. I think they're. So peel the corner, and if I was Yoshimura, I, I would freeze on that red. I wouldn't. I wouldn't yeah. move anything. Yeah. If you could on one for one shot. Down to thirds for stones, but. Uh, um. They could ever put a freeze right on that TY and Pinties. You know, threes in the mix. It's pretty gradual. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. You got it. Tracy's kind of gambling that they won't get them lined up perfectly. I think Team Flurry's okay to give up two here. They just don't want to give up three. Ooh. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Looked like you could have done some more damage, but uh Yeah, I don't think they wanted to. They Hello. talked about it. They didn't want to jiggle the thing the stuff in the middle for Team Yoshimira and they just hit it enough that they didn't touch anything in the house. It's a good call here too. Yoshimura's going around the corner guard. It's also a good option because really Tracy can't hit anything easily. Get this buried and let Flurry decide what to do. Yeah, just get it in the ring somewhere. Well, the middle is, is set up so well for Team Yoshimura right now that I, I expect that Tracy will play something on the corner, whether it's a peel or if they can access the one in the house, that they would take a, a shot at that one. Pretty good. Can't hit it. Like now. <laughs> Liz is saying, what do you like now? Oh, okay. Throwing a guard. It's nice here. Yeah. Okay. Game on. Yeah. <laughs> Mine really worked at the end. This guard has to be made, or big end is in the mix here. A little bit of pressure on Selena Negavan to deliver here. Wait if you can. Got the three up and Wait. this guard's missed. Wait. Four's almost Sports in the mix. Net. Need to curl a bit. Should Just curl. a two and a half. Lies good. Lies great. We're there for weight. Well, well then, then, a little whoa. tighter than Sportsnet. No, no, no. Okay, line's good. Whoa, we're whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, we're tight. Yeah. Good, Selena. Good, nice spot. Pretty good. Uh. Well, 
Well, big shot here. Trying to run this back onto the right side of the, excuse me, the left side of that red as we're looking at it. You can get rid of all the yellows. Leave two reds in the play. more of that redstone in the rings and also unlucky that they've kind of separated them so the double's not that easy anymore and they didn't even push one to be a uh, fourth shot okay okay time should be good tracy's gonna hit the red i think that's a good play three up again if she rolls out three still in the mix they can uh, make the double roll buried so now some key stones coming up in the seventh end and try to keep the shooter in the eight foot. Sure. Tracy Fleury may concoct a, an escape from what looked like earlier trouble Tracy here and really put some pressure on Yoshimura here in the seventh end. Just a little less. Sorry? A little less? This could go a long way to telling the tale of the match. Touchdown. Kristen, Kristen, you gotta go. That is way out there. Yeah, she had quite a bit of ice, too. It's a good sweep there by Kristen. Punches that one stone out. So Kristen taking the angle to try to make it make it curl and they got it just enough well, there, I think there's room here if they can play the uh, the double here Jill and they can roll the shooter in lie two buried bring keep three in the mix Key comparison brought to you by WFG, helping families have better financial futures. Tracy Fleury curling at 94%. Yoshimura at 48%. And there is no more stark comparison in this game than that one right there. Yoshimura needs a big shot now. Well, you know what? All, all will be forgiven if she makes this double and rolls buried, Scott, to, uh, you know could bring three right back into it. Close. Just didn't quite get the roll, but nice double. That curls another half inch and it's buried. <laughs> Trying to make a curl there at the end. Tried to roll buried. Yeah, it just needs to come up a little bit more. Again, if you're Tracy Flurry here, yes, the hit and roll under is available, but they, she cannot get anywhere near that corner guard. So again, expect her to hit this and roll to the open and leave Yoshimura with a chance for two. Sounds like they might be trying to get under a little bit, Mike. They're talking about Kristen taking it uh, once they're by the top one, which means yeah, they'd be trying it, to make it. it curl, trying to make it finish. And, you know, in her mind's eye, she's going, just don't throw it soft. <laughs> well, yeah. soft is never usually an option on arena ice. No. <laughs> Tracy Fleury's last in the seventh. She has not won a slam, so wants to be sure with this. Well out there. Right over, it's going. Hard! Keep going. Hard, you got it! Keep going. And 
same thing? No. Okay. That's fine. Good, try it. That's how she had to throw that. That was a good, good, sure. good throw. Much different nice ice game. taken here by Yoshimura. I think that uh, Flurry's team will be happy with the only giving up two. Like we talked all in about the possibility of of three being in the mix, and that would have not obviously been ideal. So I think they're happy with only giving up two, and having the hammer being one up is a pretty good situation. As soon as that double was made and stayed frozen, they were in trouble. Again. This needs to be made. Hit and stay. Easier said than done, we've seen so far. This to get within one for Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan. First time to the playoffs at a Grand Slam event. She's into the final with a chance. Nails it dead on. That's two in the seventh end. And now trails by one. Six, five. Tracy Flurry, she'll have the hammer in eight. World Financial Group Canada believes that families deserve sound financial futures. Our independent financial professionals provide clients with a strategy to achieve their goals. Through World Financial Group Canada's affiliated companies, our licensed agents offer an array of financial products to help clients find the right product no matter where they are in life. If you're ready to prepare for your future, contact your local World Financial Group financial professional, helping Canadian families have better financial futures. Brian loves cycling, especially the hills. He's been riding his bike to work up the infamous Humbercrest Hill every day since 1991. But it's not 1991 anymore. Brian could use a bottle of Boost, a nutritional drink with protein, vitamins, and minerals, for when he's not getting enough in his diet to help him keep doing what he loves. The difference between a clean tractor and a dirty one can be found in the heart of the person who holds the key. Coyote, we dig dirt. Pinty's Chicken Wings, just like you get at the pub. Official sponsor of the Calgary Stampeders. 20 Western Division titles and seven time Grey Cup champs. Pinty, making great food fun. Men's hair goes through a lot. So make sure it's ready for anything. Dove Men Plus Care Fortifying Shampoo, especially engineered for men, to leave your hair stronger and more resilient. Dove Men Plus Care. Need a change of scenery? Kayak searches hundreds of travel sites, even our competitors, so you can be confident you're getting the right flight at the best price. Kayak. Search one and done. The CBC app and cbcsports.ca for all your sports news and stories. Following seven years away from the sport, Brett Hayden stunned the swimming world when he announced that he'll be returning to the pool. The 36-year-old, who last competed at the 2012 Olympics, explains the decision to return in his player's own voice essay titled, Back for a Second Splash. While the Canadian figure skating program goes through plenty of change, the familiar faces of pair skater Kirsten Moore Towers and Michael Marinaro remain. Moore Towers joins host Anastasia Busis of the Player's Own Voice podcast to discuss how the relationships of a mature athlete develop, the unhealthy body image the sport sometimes displays, and her desire to leave figure skating better than when she found it. In the moment at the Masters, North Bay Memorial Gardens, the Pinty's Grand Slam of curling, and we go to end number eight of the women's final with Tracy Fleury having the hammer and the lead 6-5 over Sayaka Yoshimura of Japan, who's forced to catch up late in the game. No surprise, Yoshimura put up a guard, and Kristen McCush made a... Very nice tick shot again. Crowd ants here. Yes, yes, yes. 
trying to remain unbiased, yeah. but... <laughs> you can give a little fist pump. It's okay. Yeah. We understand. I don't think I'm hiding anything. Yeah. <laughs> Full disclosure. Well, Five Rock really needed to make them make it twice, so... Let's see if she can replicate that first effort here. Shamara is going to try to put her their guards in a position that maybe when Liz goes to play appeal, she jams on a, another guard, another rock that's there. Maybe it spins in the house. Anything to try to keep some stuff around and maybe get a little lucky. That's fine there. If nothing changes here, you'll see Yoshimura okay. go around that yellow and then maybe on her first and then try to lie two on make Tracy throw against the the loss on her last one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, right here. Liz Fife, uh, yeah, the back. not emanating pleasure with that shot right now. No, not great. The only good news is that's still only a corner guard. But you're not happy with the throw. If you're, if you're Liz. Sorry. <laughs> if you're Yoshimura, you're gradually trying to sneak that guard closer to the center line as the end wears on. thing for Tracy Fleur here is that right hand side of the sheet as we're looking at it is wide open she threw that draw to the button if you remember in end number six to win the game so if uh, opportunity presents itself she'll always have that shot she knows so well all red out front right now well, we'll see uh, Yoshimura continue to guard that stone and maybe try to get half around yeah. on her last. Clean. So yeah. I like. What do you like, Joe? If you were yeah, ready. I I like that. I'm a little surprised that they went in on that one. I thought maybe they would throw a guard closer to the center line as, as right. you had suggested, but they decided to go around and bite the house. If they keep playing it out as you suggested, Mike, they're, they're they are leaving an outturn draw for Tracy to the forefoot. If they start moving the guard a little closer to to center line, they might be able to cut down her scoring area. I think they're calling heavy that they're coming in right now. This will give a double opportunity to uh, Selena. I don't want to wreck here. Yes, 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 to be clear, that was not the call. And that's really not much of a, a shot in the rings, to be honest. Just your Tracy Fleury, you just peel that top one out. That back one's not going to scare you. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I mean, you got it. It's pretty big miss there. That was a guard attempt. But yeah, that is a really big miss. 15 feet heavy. They did what they could with it. I think the sweepers gave a heads up call right. on it, but uh, yeah, it's uh, not ideal. <laughs> Good 
picks it out. Time to go. Okay. Time. I'll call a timeout here. You know, first instinct would be to throw the center guard. The problem is the center guard, you know, is going to give a free opportunity for Flurry to run a double, try to double the two reds off, and then you're really in trouble. You need to lie to Yoshimura when you're down one. So Roshi Seto out to chat with the team. I think I'd be tempted to throw in more guard. Probably two more guards. You know, what Tracy's going to appeal. You know that, I'm sure, right? Well, two, two choices, really. I mean, if you go here, there's no double shooter would stay and if you mm. go here you're really hoping for a miss but it gives that free run at that <laughs> at the double here you don't want to give Tracy that shot to get out of the end when you're when you're one down I think you have to throw a, a corner you could throw a corner on the other side if you like as well that's a very difficult double I see him smiling. Well, we're in trouble here, kids. <laughs> if you translate the coach, <laughs> what do we do now? I can't imagine a scenario where Tracy will draw. I agree. Maybe on Tracy's first. <laughs> so we've decided to go more uh, as a corner guard. Decision-making time for Tracy will begin on her next shot. You got it. If the guard's put right back there, though, she almost has to peel. I agree. Last rock of the end for Selena Negevin. And then we're down to skips, stones, in what has been a very tightly played match. Yoshimura is gonna, going to just replace that guard, same spot. We peel and then they're probably going to top eight. Okay. Now it's up to the skips. Two rocks for Sakai Yoshimura, two for Tracy Fleury. Going a long way to telling the tale of this final match. The Masters. Yoshimura needs to steal one here to stay in it, force an extra end. Yeah, same spot would be great. You're Tracy briefly talking to Selena back there. Said if we peel. Probably gonna draw a top eight. Yeah, I think that is correct. Okay. 
I'm gonna make this curl. So if you're Yoshimura, you're gonna try to get your last shot into this area where Tracy cannot hit that on the nose and be shot rock. And you can almost go, as say, almost go full eight, even an inch or two into the eight foot on her last and force her to go wide around that if she wants to draw. That would be the ideal spot. Okay, you got it. You got it, Trace. So one thing in this game, Scott, you know what your opponents are going to do, and there's not a lot you can do about it, so you have to have a, a plan, and that's what uh, Tracy and Selene have already talked about what they're going to do. Plan, and then execute the shot that you plan. Looks good here. Peels it off. And now, Yoshimura wants to put it right where it's supposed to be. They're talking about coming in, actually. I'm surprised here. Yeah, they're talking about uh, maybe even going on to the side of the forefoot, but it just leaves her a, an open hit for the win. Full conference now. <laughs> He's freezing the kicker, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about it for a minute or two and... If I was Team Flurry, I'd be happy that they're talking about this as an option. Yeah, if they're going to draw to the open side, I would go a little wider again, where you can get it right out to the almost full eight on the on the T line. That's okay, where it only has to roll a couple of inches out. Anything near the forefoot, Tracy's going to hit it. What is the decision? What will they do? Uh, <laughs> lots of time. No timeouts left, so they cannot consult with their coach on this one. <laughs> the one challenge throwing it over on this side of the sheet is that they've played the, uh, you know, every shot has been on the other side so far, so to get to get the weight right and uh, the ice right is going to be tricky. There you go, three minutes. Play. There we go, right on the P and Pinties. Really deliberating this. <laughs> they said freezing the kicker, Scott. Okay. Okay. All right, we have consensus. Now she'll set the ice. And once again, the crowd very responsive, very knowledgeable curling fans here in North Bay. Into the game every step of the way. They're a very appreciative crowd of any sort of good shots. They were like that at the Women's Worlds in 18 as well. Just cheering for everybody. So here's the last volley for Sayaka Yoshimura of Sapporo, Japan. Can she create a difficult execution for Tracy Fleury to get this win? Yes, 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 yes,
this is it's about almost exactly where they <laughs> called it. Tracy would have had a discussion. But if it comes deep enough, they're going to hit it, and sure enough, here comes the hit. Calm, cool, and collected is Tracy Fleury, the 33-year-old okay, from it. Sudbury, Ontario, now curling out of Manitoba. Took over what was Kerry Anderson's team. And now with a hit and stay exactly the way she wants it, yep, looking yep, at yep. her first Grand yes. Slam victory. Gotta go Sweepers here. are on it. did a great job here. Scott just enough to hold it. And they have the catcher in the wings, luckily. What a finish. I mean, even if we didn't have the catcher, even if they didn't have the catcher, uh, you know, they were going to an extra hand. Can you believe it, says Tracy Fleury. Yes, I can. Oh, the escape hatch. Let's get down to Kevin Martin. Masters champion, first Grand Slam. How's that feel? It feels amazing, yeah, yeah. And to do it so close to home is extra special. I have a lot of family and friends here, so yeah, it means a lot. Well, let's talk about your team's performance. It was fantastic this week. How do you feel about the way your team played? They played amazing. They made my job really easy out here. Uh, the three of them were making a ton of shots in front of me, and yeah, really proud of how they played. Well, big congratulations. Thank you very much. Thanks so much. Thanks so much to Kevin Martin, and congratulations to Tracy Fleury. There's Selena Negevin and her husband, Connor. Great reactions here is Tracy Fleury, Tish Horgan, her mom as she takes the Masters Championship in a tight one over Japan. We're back to North Bay in a moment. Company bonus.